Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, today we are going to be taking on the new Wicked Bloodline Extreme Super Battle stage that just dropped on both sides of the game. Now, before we get into it, I want to quickly apologize to you guys for the, you know, lack of content on the channel recently. I'm not sure if you can hear it in my voice, but this past week, I've been feeling uh, pretty awful. Pretty awful. And that's why I haven't been filming as much as normal, just trying to rest as much as possible and uh, get better, right? And I do feel a lot better than I did a week ago, but obviously still not 100%. So hopefully over the next couple of days, I'll be back to normal and you guys will see me a lot more as well. But anyways, with that said, this is the team we're going to be using today. We got the double LR full power Frieza leads the Tech Transforming Frieza, the Fizz Angel Final Form Frieza slash Angel Golden Frieza, the AGL Golden Frieza, Int Final Form Frieza, the free to play one, and uh, also the Int Third Form Frieza. And uh, the items are the same as always. We got the uh, Princess Snake, Aider, Whis, and Icarus. And with all that out of the way, let's jump right into it. And here we go. Obviously, feel free to race me if you guys want to. Uh, for this first fight, we are facing King Vegeta and Bardock. So the dads. And we got the double full power Frieza's. I think the friend one is maybe a little bit better than mine. Oh no, it's about the same. Okay, so I'm going to keep mine because it's my Frieza, so it's better, obviously. And uh, let's go for... And Icarus first to be safe because I don't really trust. I mean, the defense is not bad for both Frieza's, but it's not amazing either. Uh, in fact, it might be smart to put the Golden Frieza in the first slot just to take all those attacks. Um, but then we don't have any links for this Frieza, which also is not ideal. So I will put my Frieza in the first slot and just hope that we don't get supered immediately because that would be really bad and uh, we can probably kill Bardock with the first Frieza um, you know what this guy's not gonna do much damage anyway so I'm not gonna give him a super let's just give him one orb so we can save the remaining orbs for the other full power Frieza and luckily we didn't get super that's perfect looking good so far looking good so far um, this additional with a crit will probably be enough. No crit? Maybe not, actually. Which would... Oh, it's still alive? Oh, he's still alive. Okay, so we did need the third super. <laughs> that third, third super is actually necessary. And there he goes. Okay, so Bardock's dead. We just have the... King Vegeta to worry about and luckily um, you know we're gonna tank this really well with our 90% damage reduction combined with the Icarus effect and if this guy can get a couple of additional supers then we might actually move on just like that but okay so just the one super um let me see okay so I think the move here would be actually to pop this active skill Get the transformation into Angel Golden Frieza, and then hope that we stun, because he gets a great chance to stun, which is 70%. He has a 70% chance to stun. If we don't get the stun off, we're still going to do some good damage, and um, yeah, it should be fine. <laughs> it should be fine. Okay, so let me see. Uh, who should we keep? This Int Frieza or this Int Frieza? I mean, this guy actually doesn't have a lot of defense now. Now that I'm thinking about it, because we need a Goku's family enemy, and we don't have that anymore, so... Yeah, putting him in the last slot might be dangerous, but my, my thought process is we're probably going to stun anyway, so it doesn't matter, right? So I might... Um, I might as well keep the Final Form Frieza in rotation to use for later. Uh, and yeah, I think this is... This is okay. Please stun. Please stun. 6.2 mil. Looking good. Looking good. Okay. 
There's a stun. And... Alright, perfect. Now, if we can kill him, that would be even better. If we're not, though... Um... We'll definitely get him out of here in next rotation. But my concern is, if there's a lot of attacks in the first slot, I might have to waste another item. And that is never a good thing. Okay, we'll see. Yeah, see? Oh, we do have the Golden Freezer, actually. Okay, uh... Yeah, okay. I mean, 90% damage reduction? Should be fine. Even with no items, right? Right? <laughs> I think. Here's the real test. Let's see. Yeah, no, we're fine. We're fine. Ajo Golden Frieza. I should have known, man. Easily one of the best tanks in the game, right? At least one of the best non-stacking tanks in the game, like from turn one. Um, there's a lot of other units that can get tankier than him long term, right? If you like greatly stack defense for like five, six turns. Um, there's a lot of units in this game that like are literally untouchable. But Golden Frieza from turn one has 90% damage reduction, so yeah, I still love that guy. That's why I brought him. It was a good choice. And now on this rotation, I'm definitely gonna put this guy here. I'm gonna pop the active skill so we can stun somebody. Uh, oh, I should probably turn off the animations. But there's no point in watching it over and over again, right? Luckily, it's not that long. Yeah, it's not like a super long active skill animation. And it also looks dope, so it's kind of worth it. Yeah, it's kind of worth it. Okay. So, let's go for a Whis this time. And then... Uh, let me see... I guess I'm gonna go for... Hmm... Let, let's go for Vegeta. Because there's a decent chance we can actually kill him with our full power Frieza attacks. And then for the stun, I'm gonna stun. It really doesn't matter, does it? Uh let's let's actually attack like Oh no, let's let's attack Goku. As long as we keep one of the Goku's family guys alive, the in Frieza will still be effective. And look at that tanking, man, that's crazy. <laughs> that's that's nice. That's nice. I hope everyone supers him. It's happening. Okay, here we go. Double digits. 60. There we go. Well, that was just a bunch of supers. Um, wasted on the Int Frieza. You always want to see that. And, um, yeah, like, like I was saying, yeah, as long as you keep one of the Raditz or the Goku alive, then the final form Frieza will still get his damage reduction, get his, 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 uh, guard. So we're fine there. Vegeta's dead, that's also great. And... Ooh, that kinda hurt. That did a lot more than I was expecting. It's okay though. Okay. And... A stun on Goku, not that it really matters. Okay, um... We're definitely gonna put the Angel... Or sorry, not Angel, Golden Frieza, just the Golden Frieza in the first slot. Uh, I'm gonna go for Nappa, I guess. Yeah, sure, let's, let's try to kill Nappa first. And then uh, I will target Goku with the third form Frieza. <laughs> I used to be a lot more casual in these videos, you know, just like not really paying attention to the game, but recently I found that they've really ramped up the difficulty um, on the newer stages. So if I don't pay attention, then there's a good chance I die. Which is just not ideal, <laughs> you know. So, I'm I'm paying more attention to the gameplay now. Definitely like thinking through my moves a lot more than before. Uh, there's Nappa, and we get a crit again, and get Raditz done as well. We can do it. Who oh, is he dead? He is dead. Perfect. Okay. So just the Goku. Just the Goku's left. <laughs> If this guy gets like three supers, he can probably kill Goku, but there's not a very good chance with that. One more. Uh, okay, alright. I mean, we just need one hit now. 
problem is are we gonna have an attack no we're not okay so i was gonna say are we gonna have an attack before we get to a, get the super but it doesn't really matter i guess because we have this active skill which i haven't seen in a long time either i actually haven't used wicked bloodline in a long time now that i think about it and it's actually one of my favorite categories in the game so i do need to use it more there you go and goku's dead easy easy love the ko screen too okay so last fight um i'm guessing goku just goku is it just goku no it's goku vegeta and trunks okay so this time i feel like it might be smart to actually hold on to the active skill for angel golden frieza or we can pop it so that we can maybe uh stun the fizz vegeta okay so first things first i'm gonna turn off my active skill animations let's transform let's do the thing and then yeah uh i just gotta make sure that i actually get a super for the angel golden frieza right so let's go for wait hold on i'm gonna pop a waste too safety first safety first okay so let's go for it doesn't matter anybody with the golden frieza um i'm gonna do goku with the full power frieza and then we'll try to stun yeah, we'll try to stun the Vegeta because there's a lot of attacks in that final slot that are scary. Oh, perfect. That's exactly who I wanted you to super, so thank you for that. <laughs> That's dope. Okay. So, yeah, hopefully we kill Goku so that all that's left is Vegeta attacks at the end. And then if we stun Vegeta, then there's no attacks at the end. Additional super. Damn. Okay, that sucks. Mmm. Stun? 70%? Come on. Come on. Yes, perfect. And the additional. Beautiful. <sighs> See, it could have been pretty bad there, man. No stun on the second super, so we needed that uh, stun on the first super. And uh, this turn, we should be pretty good defense. Uh, I mean, that third form freeze always worries me. Um, just to be safe, I'm going to go for an Aider. Some additional defense right there. And uh, now we should be okay. Now we should be okay. I'm going to actually go for the kill on the Trunks. Just... So, like, there's no attacks at all to worry about against third form Frieza. <laughs> okay, 57, 26. Nice. Double supers at least. Possibly triple. Yep, okay. Trunks is dead, for sure. And we might be able to kill off Goku as well. If we get lucky with the third super. No third super. No problem. Yeah, no trunks was my, my, my main concern regardless. So we're looking good. We're in good shape right now. This won't be bad. Yep, 104. <laughs> like I said, no problem. And uh, this guy's going to do his thing, you know. we get like a couple of attacks off. Unfortunately, his supers don't do that much damage until later on. Um, so in like shorter events like this, he's actually not that effective. I'm not even sure why I brought him to be honest, <laughs> but he's here now. Can't really go back. So it's whatever. Um, let's go for an Icarus here. Yep. And then full power Frieza in the first slot, tech Frieza in the second. That's fine, right? Yeah. Cause Goku's going to be dead for sure and then um i think tech frieza will hold up and uh, obviously agl freeze is gonna hold up so we'll move on to the next turn with no issues here very likely very likely 
Okay. Goku's dead. Additional attack. Not a super. But this guy could potentially double super. And he does. And if he crits here, then we're done. He doesn't crit there. You know what? It's fitting. It's fitting that Golden Frieza is the one to finish things off. Because defensively, he was the MVP. Okay, he... he was very clutch in a lot of the rotations, so he deserved that final shot. I gotta say, he deserved it. So there you have it, guys. Um, a new stage was it 32? I think it's 32 of Extreme Super Battle Road. Uh, Wicked Bloodline only done in just under 14 minutes. Obviously, could have been you know less if I I talk less, but um, that's part of the appeal of these videos to some of you guys, right? The interaction, like. If you, if you didn't want me to talk, like some people say, yo, why do you talk so much in the videos, man? I'm like, if you don't want to watch me talk, then you can see a lot of other videos out there without any commentary, right? Literally just gameplay. Um, they're out there, so you can go watch those. But if you want to see someone and talk and like go through their thought process and everything, then these are the kind of videos that uh, you, you go to, right? Anyways, uh, <laughs> I don't know I'm rambling. as <laughs> my bad. Um, it's good to be back, guys. It's good to be back. I'll definitely do one more today before I uh, go take a nap, I guess, because, um, like I said, still not feeling great. But uh, I want to do the other Super Battle Road stage. I think it's Bond of Master and Disciple for a regular Super Battle Road. So look out for that. But this was Wicked Bloodline, Extreme Super Battle Road. You know, not easy, but not bad by any means as far as Extreme Super Battle Road goes. And uh, as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.